Well, it's going to be another beautiful day on the Little Pinhook Lake. It's a little park in South Bend, Indiana. It's a little gym that I like. Uh, it's, it's a pretty interesting little pond. For all you pond hoppers out there, it's got everything you would want. I mean, it's got pike, steelhead, surprisingly, rainbow trout, bass, crappie, bluegill, catfish, walleye, and on occasion, and this is crazy, but I've caught them in here, salmon. So this little park has got it all, and little, I mean little. It is a small park, but it's just it's just really cool. And it's pretty neat that it's just right here in the middle of South Bend. Well, let's go find some fish. All right, so we're gonna switch it up. Uh, since the drop shot's not really paying off, let's switch it up to this little finesse jig. Switch it up to this little finesse jig. Purple and blue. Or I should say purple with some green flake in it. That's going to be a nice little treat for these bass. Still going to be using the spinning rod because this is such a lightweight jig. And I'll be able to, should be able to cast it just fine with it. Spinning rod, no worries. Ooh, that thing looks good. There we go. That's gotta be a good one. That's gotta be a good one. Boy, that thing hit. That is a good one. Okay, that's a good size bass right there. Pick, ooh, he was not well hooked. I mean, he was hooked, but not as well as I'd like. All right. All right, well, let's get spun around. And there he is, guys. It's a good, healthy looking bass. Man, he's got that red upper lip right there chowing down on some crayfish looks pretty good not too bad nice fat one here let's get it in the sunlight there you go there's some good color on that Got some good copper on top looks good all right buddy here we go i'm gonna put you back in there it goes I was just thinking it was getting good temperatures. It's almost 50 degrees in the water. It's weird too, because I felt the thud like thump thump. And I thought for sure I was just on a branch, but after that second thud, it's like, no, it definitely is a bass. 17 and a quarter, I think it was. So it's it pretty good to put me on the board, especially in March. I think I might have to switch out though to a different rod, because much as that worked out, I think it'd be better to be on my other rod, especially if it start getting bigger than that. Second one. We're gonna be we're gonna get five today. Just keep this up. This one's not nearly as big as the other one, but it's all right. I saw this shallow shadow following it. You don't want to be hooked, neither do I. Now that's a hook set. <laughs> that's much better. That's where it needs to be. Right in that nose. Okay, so this guy's good. 
That's the second one. It's only a 15 incher. So let's go get some more. I think I may have found the pattern. Patient game with the the jig bite early in the season. You gotta be real patient. You gotta take it slow. Yeah, because any crayfish that are around, they're not really jumping around. They're they're moving real slow, trying to stay hidden. if that was a bite or not. I can't tell if that's a bite. Might have been a bite. Man, that was so subtle if it was. Usually, usually I'd swing for the fences on it, but last two times I've been able to tell. And that one just couldn't. Man, I cannot tell. Oh yeah. Oh man, that was so subtle. Wow, that was such a subtle bite. He's probably got that thing swallowed. Such a subtle bite. Hopefully he's all right. Man, that was crazy. Oh yeah, he's got that thing choked. Yeah, he, yeah, he, he slammed it. That's right, we got, let's see. Actually, he's really good. It's just, just at the top of his mouth. Not too bad at all. Yep, not too bad at all. All right, I got him. There he is. Small little guy, early season, but again, red lips. Chowing down. I like how this one's gonna come across that limb. Anytime I can do that, I try to do it. I try to cast over a limb so it'll come back over. So I can kind of fish both sides of that and also bass I've noticed that when something goes over a log they see it on one side and they turn around and they see it drop it just instincts they just fire on it it's a lot of times I get bites I'm gonna make my jig do that That was definitely a fish. I still think I have him on, but he's all tangled up in something. Yeah, I still have him. I don't know how to, I don't know. Man, dude, you just gotta get yourself undone. I still got him somehow. There he is. Come here, big boy. Ooh. Oh, yes. <laughs> uh, CQB, the big old fatty. Man, that was cool. Whew. Wow. Okay, well, I'm glad they're out to play today. That's a lot of fun. This guy, this big old chunk. 
Oh, and he popped off in the net. Oh, look at that guy. Bam. Yeah, another one. See, look how red the upper lip is. The upper lip is just red. Man, it's a good looking fish. It's fun though, man. And uh, I tell you, like, the bite is just so soft. They're not being too progressive. But we're gonna let this bad boy go. Glad I switched to this rod though. The other rod, I would have been in trouble with that one. Who thinks that there's a bass on that log over there? Oh man, he got too far out in front of me. There's not much I could do on that one. I tried to stick it to him good, but man. And that was a good, that was a, that was the big boy of the day right there. That was the champion bass. We lost them guys. Lost the champion bass right there. There we go. That's what we're talking about. That's better. That's much better. That's a good one. That's what we're talking about. Good looking bass. Man, these things are are fat and uh pooping all over me, but short, short, fat, getting ready for the spawn, I guess. Pre-spawn. It's 50 degrees, so you know, it's about that time. Well, that's gonna do it for today's video. Um the results, I will take it because it is the middle of winter in Indiana right now. And in two days, the weather forecast is snow. So those bass that I caught today, I'll take them. I can throw them up on the leaderboard for this month's online tournament and uh, see how I'm doing after just day one. But in two days, I don't think there's gonna be anybody fishing. Um, it's just crazy that we're gonna be getting snow. Anyways, hope you guys are enjoying these videos as much as I am making them for you. Do me a favor, subscribe to the channel, like them, share them. You know the deal. Anyways, until next time, you guys take care of yourselves and each other. We'll see you again. In my opinion, I think these are these are pretty cool. Cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Large mouth bass right there. You got cool in your socks, you know you're cool. Because your socks tell you so. I don't know if that was one or not. I really don't know. Because I know where they are.
Let's get another fish. They're all over here in this corner. I can't tell if that's a bite. We're gonna make my jig do that. Come here, big boy. I tried to stick it to him good. I am poop off my board, dude. Oh, yes. 